A new day dawns for Hampton Roads' largest private employer. Newport News Shipbuilding today launched its newest venture using a plasma burning machine to make the ceremonial first cut of steel for the brand new Columbia class of submarines. Military reporter Mike Gooding tells us why the momentous occasion is crucial to the shipyard and vital to the Navy. The new era began with the first cut of steel. Newport News will be responsible for supplying approximately 22% of each of the planned 12 Columbia class subs, building modules for final assembly by prime contractor General Dynamics Electric Boat in Groton, Connecticut. Together, they will build the Ohio class replacement subs through 2042, meaning decades of workload certainty for the two yards. Each of the $4.9 billion Columbia class subs is projected to last 42 years, meaning the later one should be around through the early to mid 2080s. This contract is the Navy's number one acquisition program, has the full support of the Navy and strong congressional support. That coupled with the recent two carrier buy provides a lot of stability in the shipbuilding uh, infrastructure in the Hampton Roads area. This is really a proud day for the Columbia program and another step as we move down the path towards building and deliver this ship for the nation's strategic deterrence. And the Navy can't wait to get it. The foundation of the kind of our democracy and our nation's defense is this program, which is why you know, I feel so fortunate to be here with the shipbuilders on a day like today as we move forward. Construction will begin on the Columbia class in October 2020, with delivery to the Navy expected sometime in 2027. In Newport News, Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.